This video will illustrate how to send images over from the IVC cameras to the FTP server. So first things first, you need to make sure that you actually have an FTP server that's connected to your uh, camera. And in my case, I have downloaded a freeware called FileZilla Server Interface to simulate this exercise. Once you have uh, the server interface open, if you're going to be using FileZilla, what you, where you need to go is to users and make sure that you actually add a user account. In this case, I already have a user account called Parmasa. You can enable a password. I don't have one in my case. Once you have a user account, then you need to define what exactly is going to be the folder or the directory where the images are going to be stored. In my case, they are going to the C drive followed by the inspector FTP folder. And this one is going to be having access by the users Parmarsa, which is the only user I have in my case. So these are the only two settings that needs to be done if you're going to be using FileZilla and then you can OK on that screen. So I'll go back to my uh, IVC Studio program. I already have an image and I can now go to the communications tab and uh, include or insert a step called send to FTP. I need to uh, define an IP address of the server. In this case, uh, the server is my PC. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, find out what is the IP address of my computer. And that's uh, 10.109.216. So I'll go ahead and uh, add that. The port number from the FileZilla was 21 as well. So I'll just leave that as to be the default. The username is uh, Parmasa and I really don't have a password. Um, now within the directory where the images are going to be stored I can create a subdirectory where I want the IVC images to go in and I could call that IVC images and the file name this can while this can be a dynamic file name uh, so that your images are let's say based on a counter one two three four or something more meaningful to you in this case it's going to be a static image I'll just call it uh, test the source bank is the bank from which you want to send the image out to. In this case, it's bank number zero because that's where my image is at. And I can send a raw 3D image, which is going to be uh, quite a bigger in size and takes uh, about half a second to a second. Or I can send a JPEG grayscale or a bitmap. I'll select a JPEG grayscale in this case. Once I'm done with that, I'll go ahead and execute that step. And uh, there is uh, my subdirectory in which the images are going to go, which is C drive inspector FTP. Within that, the inspector image, the IVC images directory got created. And I can double click on that. And I have one image, which is a test. I'll go ahead and double click on that and uh, open it up with any of the graphics software. And there you go. That's the images uh, that came about to be.